Hey, welcome back to M Hood Fishing. I'm at a pumping station running a carp video. And I want to catch some catfish. And they're small, there's little channels here. So I brought something that's been in the fridge for a while. This is strawberry flavored bacon. Now let's show you how I made it real quick. Before I make this bait, I'm gonna take this pack of cheap bacon and cut it in half. Easy peasy. Scissors are sharp. All right, here we go. Half a pack of bacon. Where have you seen this before? Now each piece has been separated and put in there individually. So let's add the flavoring, which here's the flavoring. How'd you guess? Strawberry gelatin. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to slowly pour this in going back and forth. If you want to call that slow, that's fine. If you want to call it quick, I don't care. You just got to get it in there kind of evenly. The whole pack. Now, gelatin is an interesting flavor, you know, strawberry especially, because it, it's hard to say. Do catfish like strawberry or do they like the... Uh, animal products that are in gelatin or maybe it's both so we got animal products on animal products with strawberry flavoring on top here we're just gonna do this you know mix it around a little bit shake it up get all that bacon coated pretty good that's probably fine don't need to add any moisture to this because this is going to sit in the fridge overnight or you know for any amount of time beyond overnight and therefore the bacon will soak that up pretty good and later on I can mix it up a little bit better but it should soak it up pretty good. All right, I have, I have a good feeling about this particular uh, bait. <laughs> huh, it's been in the fridge for quite some time and it don't stink, it don't smell rotten. Let's see what this looks like. Wow, that is like the brightest bacon, red bacon I've ever seen. It kind of sort of smells like strawberry. I'll tell you what, it kind of smells like Play-Doh a lot. Strawberry is a is a flavor that will attract catfish, channel catfish like crazy, and carp. So let's uh let's break some of this off. This is this bacon is really hard. It feels more cured than it should be. So maybe it'll stay on the hook longer, and which I have a hook here somewhere. I'm out in Harvey at a pumping station, if you don't know already. So what we're gonna do is, this is a OT2 octopus hook. I'm just gonna roll it on there like that, and hopefully it'll stay on. And we got another route here we're gonna do with strawberry bacon, and it's got a different hook size, so let's get to that. All right, so I forgot to put this lead on here. I was about to cast, and I realized it was really light. So this is a lead trolley, and we're putting two-ounce bank sinker on there. And I'm going to go ahead and put this out and get the other rig ready and all that good stuff. All right, this rig here is a three-ounce on a three-way and a three octopus and we're gonna put the bacon on the same way we did the other hook and put this out here we go got us got us a fish on strawberry bacon what do we got here oh it's this is a sizable fish 
No, that's a sizable fish, man. That's a turtle. I know. This is a problem with bacon. Like, there's got to be a time of the year where bacon's going to be great. It's probably when it's colder. It's kind of a rare event here in Louisiana. I'm not surprised. I used to fish a lot with bacon when I was a kid, and yeah, I caught turtles then too. Oh, good meat and dessert all in one, buddy. There he goes. Oop, he found his own way. Wow, both my lines just did something weird. I think something just swam into both those lines. This is crazy. I, <clears throat> a spotted gar swam into my line and got wrapped in the braid in his mouth. This is a uh, this line has strawberry bacon on it. <laughs> yeah, he's probably sketching that line out right now. It's 80 pound braid. Come on, calm down. I cannot get him unwrapped so I'm just gonna have to cut the line just like that <laughs> that's that get that line off of him and you're going to let him go he is totally ready to go too don't come back another fish here this is on strawberry bacon Catching all my fish at the last minute. Oh, oh, oh. Little stinker looks like he swallowed the hook. I think I got the biggest cat of the evening. All right, buddy, go on. Awesome. I finally caught a catfish on bacon. I don't think I've done that since I was a kid and it was strawberry bacon So that's like extra cool, right? Strawberry. Well It's pretty late right now and, and honestly it was a pretty slow session but there's another video that I was running alongside this catfish video and That worked out nice fish in that video. So check that out. It's a nice carp. All right. See you next time